Welcome. Their arms just <laughs> grazed so hard. Gross. <laughs> Uh, hey everyone, Had here, and I'm joined with my lovely sister, Danny. Today we're going to be doing a Q&A. You submitted questions. Danny's going to read them to me. I'm yelling very loud right now. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> here we go. Drew asks, do you two talk about boys a lot? Yeah, a fair, a fair amount. I'd say so. Sometimes we're out and I'm like, oh, I like that guy. And you're like, ew. And yes. then sometimes you're like, oh, I like that guy. And I'm like, oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Running for the hills. <laughs> JC asks, if you could date any cartoon character of any TV show movie you've worked on, who would you date? That I've worked on? Ooh, Grown Up Hiccup. Ooh, that's a good choice. He's sexy. He is that cute. That stubble. Oh, that leg. That big leg. <laughs> Hopping around. Diego Sal... Sal... Okay. Diego... Diego asks, <laughs> <laughs> who has the worst ex? <laughs> well, I've never really had a serious relationship, so I'm going to say Danny. Cool. Let's not talk about them. <laughs> <laughs> what was the gayest thing you remember Hat doing when you were growing up? Wearing capris. That was when we were growing up. I made that as a conscious decision as a full grown adult. <laughs> capris. <laughs> They're practical. You get the protection of pants with a breeze of shorts. <laughs> what more do you need in life? Oh gosh, a lot. The man. The <laughs> man. <laughs> Tell me about it. Who would win in an arm wrestling contest? Why can't I beat you? Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm a man. <laughs> what is the weirdest inside joke you both have? Sometimes we just randomly make bird noises. This is true. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a sad owl. Will you do a dance for us? <laughs> okay. do, do the manliest laugh you can. <laughs> sound like Woody Woodpecker. How many hats do you got, and what is the origin of the nickname? I actually don't know this. I have too many to count, I think. Mm. But right now, off the top of my head, I would say, ha, huh, that was a pun, I didn't even mean it. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna say 25, but the ones that are actually in a constant rotation, it's probably about five or six. And what was the other question? What is the origin of the nickname? When I worked at DreamWorks, I was an intern, and I was wearing my hat all the time, and I had to go give these papers to the director that I was working with at the time and I nervously knocked on the door and I walked in and there's all these important people there, really high level executives at DreamWorks. The director was in the back of the room and I was like, <laughs> here you go. And then as I was leaving, he didn't know my name, I was an intern. He just said across the whole room, thanks, hat. <laughs> and then I told everybody what happened and they all thought it was funny and then I adopted the nickname. Cool story. Cool story, bro. <laughs> Bro! <laughs> Christopher Cortez asks, how do you hit on boys? Mostly with my fist. <laughs> hey. What's up? You wanna date me? No? Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I'm just gonna fist you. <laughs> well, no. Get your sister to draw you. Nobody wants that. Whiteboard. Marker. Draw me. It's so good, Drew. Hold that, hold that whiteboard up a little like bit. It looks like it sorry. Are you ready to show it? <laughs> I am so Hitler. Sorry. <laughs> hold on, let me. Oh gosh. <laughs> oh, that's right. They're already braided. Oh, did your mama break your pubes for you? <laughs> yeah, I bet she did. Did your mama break your pubes for you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoops, okay. Have you noticed the fox in her pocket? What does the fox say? <laughs>